everyone, it's Sea Salt Sweets, and welcome back to part 6. So, in the last video, we found a bunch of Masao's body parts, all but one, and in the end, you noticed that I kind of got stuck a bit. Um, I looked, I've looked around more, obviously, and I'm not sure where else to go. Um, I'm, I guess I'm going to go back to Miss Fuckface and see if she has any hints for me. Because I don't want to waste too much time, you know what I mean? So, I'll head over there. Um, I don't know, I'm afraid it's going to be something really obvious, and you guys are going to be like screaming in the comments on the earlier videos, like, hey, check here. But, I mean, by the time you see like this video and stuff like that, or any of the other ones, I will have already played through this game since I sat down all at once and recorded like my whole gameplay and I'm just splitting them up into videos to upload. Um, oh gosh, I don't know. I really hate asking for hints to be honest. I know we didn't check too much in here except for the bookshelves, so... But I doubt there'd really didn't mean to do that. I doubt there would really be, you know, anything in here. Blah, blah, blah. Tomo won't do anything either. Beautiful lilies. Uh, wait. What? Take them out of the vase. Take or leave. Hang on, leave, because I didn't save first. There we go. I didn't even know you could- I thought it just said beautiful lilies? Well, I mean, I haven't clicked the lilies really, so I guess I wouldn't know. Got lilies. Okay. Uh. I still don't know what you do with lilies, to be honest, so I guess I'm gonna talk to her. What can I do for you? Get hints. You have to offer up six items. Certain location. Six items. Is that supposed to actually be like her body parts? Maybe? I don't know. Have you seen the first floor hall's blackboard? What is that code supposed to represent? I suspect it's showing a place in the school. Oh well, yeah, I mean, I've seen that before, but I don't know what it's talking about, to be honest. Because it was just like a bunch of spaces and letters? Adorn these places. I mean, there's like one, two, three, four, five in a row each. And I don't know what these little D's are supposed to be. B, A, C. Mm, I don't know. Five rows. Well, wait. One, two, three, four. I don't know, the desks just really seem like fillers though. There's five by one, two, three, four, five, six. And maybe this would be the D, but haha -ha, the D. But um no. I don't know. I guess I'll look back at the blackboard. W was it six vertical that they were in? One, two, three, four, five, six, maybe. B, A, C. B, A, C. Well, the B was in the second row. This is B, 2B. 2B? There's a vase in the desk. Oh my god, so it's a map of the desks. Okay, that... Hang on, and lilies, right? Because those are vases? Oh my god. Pressing all the wrong buttons because I'm so excited. I think I figured it out. Okay, so that was B. I'll probably like fast forward in between the travels so you guys don't get too bored, so. Okay, crap. This is classroom A, was it here? I f totally forgot to look where A was. I think it's there, yeah. And then the last was C. C was lower. Somewhere around here. Yes. Okay, so there we go. We found the three vases. 
That was a pretty hard puzzle, though. Like, I don't know how they would normally... Oh, I mean, I guess I figured out easy enough. I just... If I wouldn't have found the lilies or asked for, like, a hint, I wouldn't have really got anything, to be honest. I wouldn't know there'd be vases or that I could even pick up the lilies. I just randomly clicked them, but... You hear a voice from nowhere. I'm waiting on the rooftop. Rooftop. Oh! That's where the, um... Yeah, this place right here. Oh god, don't touch me. So will they finally let me talk to him? No. Oh, there's a chest here. There's... Okay, no. No, let me save. I don't want to, like, die and have to redo that. There's a treasure chest. Open it. Yes. Ew. That doesn't look like torso at all. Masala's eyes? Why wouldn't we find her torso, though? Like... Oh, God. I don't know. It seems like we would have found a torso instead, because we've got everything. Brain, head, eyes, arms. Well, arms, hands. And then legs and her heart. But we're kind of missing, like, a big part, like, her freaking neck to pelvic, I don't know. Um, six, Miss Fuckface said that we had to offer six items. I'm guessing that's what the shrine is, and that's to lay her body to rest, so. Ugh, God, I'm going all the wrong ways, I'm sorry. We go down here. Save again. And we can finally put Masao to rest. Right? Offer Masao's arms on the altar? Yes. I guess it's just going to tell me where her stuff goes. Offer her legs. Offer her heart. I hope these don't have to go in an order. Because I do not remember seeing anything that needed an order, to be honest. Her head in her brain. All the parts were offered, but nothing happens. Oh no, come on. Why isn't anything happening? No. Nothing happens. But, do they really have to be moved? No. Uh. Sacrifice the body or the curse will never end. Well, there's her body. Don't tell me it's because we really are missing her torso. Like, thank you. Oh, that's sweet. Um, wait, where's the teacher? Where did we leave him again? In the infirmary? Does he have something to do? Okay, blah, blah, blah. He's still so shady, I swear to God. I hope all you guys agree with me about that. Can we talk to uh, Oni Galoris about it? I don't know. If I can ever, like, figure out how to navigate this school. Here we go. It would either be him or I guess we talk to Miss Library again, but... Or Miss Fuckface, not Miss Library. We renamed her. I see. So you sacrificed her body at the altar. However, this alone doesn't seem to have undone the curse. We will need a we will need a live sacrifice. A live sacrifice? Are they gonna like? Oh my God! Is that the last grave we kill Toma? Live sacrifice. Did you see the red tombstones in the abyss? Well, yes, I did actually. The spirit of the ones whose names are there must be sacrificed to free hers. There are four tombstones, so there must be four names. Three of them already have names engraved in them. There's just one left. Someone must be the last sacrifice. Then I'll I'll be the sacrifice. Whoa. Damn, I'm brave. Why would Well, I mean, I guess it's honorable. And I'd probably sacrifice myself for a friend, but I eh, don't oh know. That is impossible. Those tombstones are tools of her hatred. Surely one who has not earned her resentment could not carve their name there. You set out to save her. 
she could not hate you. There are others still alive. Think well on who must be sacrificed. The fucking teacher. We're sacrificing the teacher. I mean, like, Toma may have done bad to her, I guess. I don't, I don't really know what he did. I guess kind of ignore, make fun of her, but, um, definitely the teacher's shady, though. Like, I hope she hated the teacher, to be honest. Someone who hates, who Masao hates. Hmm. Okay, can we just kill the teacher already? Because I hate him. I don't know about Masao, but... Let's see, it's probably this way. I certainly hate the teacher. And I'm pretty sure he freaking killed our best friend, Ayaka, to be honest. Like, he was left alone with her, and then suddenly a monster attacks her. What is it? Is the curse still in effect? Maybe Masao had a grudge on him because he didn't listen to her. So if I kill him... Man, how talk to Toma first. But to be honest, I really do want to kill the teacher. So I'll of course save before it. So that we can see both endings, right? But um, yeah, I so want to kill the teacher. Just needs to happen. Snore. I can't think of anyone left but Toma that Masao could have a grudge against. No. Okay, so I'm gonna go back to Onigawaris and um, save in two different spots so that I can have a choice in like, you know, who I wanna kill and who I don't wanna kill. Or, I mean, not that, but you know, so that I can show you both of the endings. So, just to get out of my system, we're going to kill the teacher first. I I just want to kill the teacher. This is just... He's so shady, you guys. Masao should have hated him, even if she didn't. I don't know if this will be the good or bad, but we're killing him. Even if he's badly hurt, I can't possibly kill him barehanded. I need something to use. Oh. Wait, don't we have a bat? You're gonna bludgeon him to death with a baseball bat? Yes. Yes. Ugh, the blood won't stop. Good. Sir, it's alright. You'll be relieved soon. Oh wow. It's okay, let me bash your brains in. Um, so that was anticlimactic. Wait, can I see him dead? Oh, he just disappears. That's great. Okay, so we killed the teacher. I'm gonna save. So, okay, so all four lit up. So it is grave. So I guess she did hate him because he said that someone that she did not hate could not be on the grave. I would hate Soda. Holy crap. He's just so creepy. Okay, so there's the stuff that actually lit up. Hmm. Masao? Thank you for finding me. Wait, don't go! Masao! Oh. Richie. Oh. I heard from the glasses chick. You done everything? What happened? Masao. She thanked me. I'm sure it's fine now. So then the curse is gone. The school will go back to normal, right? Well, yeah, except all your friends are dead. But you know, yeah, we're gonna go back to normal. It's getting bright out. Toma, let's go outside. So, it's still kind of shady on how Masao died, though. Because I don't know... This is the classroom. Is everything back to normal? Maybe this will tell how she died? Huh? Oh yeah, well, okay, here we go. Huh? Masao? Masao! Oh. Can't you see me? So I guess Masao's showing us now why she hated everyone. 
Listen, everybody, I got big news. I think you'll agree to this one's a riot. Oh, I read that wrong. Anyway. What now, Yoshino? Cut the crap and tell us. <laughs> one of the girls here likes Toma. Huh? Are you confessing to me? You wish it was me. Uh, oh no. Poor Masao. It's none other than that simple girl who never stands out. Miss Sal! Huh? Really? Uh, I... Look, Tom is right over there. Confess your undying love. Oh, poor Miss Sal. Uh, Alright, I'll date you, Miss Sal. Whoa, what? Huh? I've kinda had a crush on you myself. Toma. Huh? Toma, are you for real? Masao? Really? You shut your trap. It's none of your business who I'm dating, Yoshino. Let's trade numbers. Uh, okay. Wait, I'm confused. He's dating her? I remember this. I was in the classroom then, too. This was just before Miss Sal went missing. Why did Yoshino tell? Well, no matter. After all, I'm Toma's girlfriend now. I should thank Yoshino. Oh, Toma sent me a text. I like you, Miss Sal. Do you like me too? T Toma! What? You sound so embarrassed. How should I reply? Oh god, I hate when they like mess with the feels. This doesn't feel like it's gonna go good at all. Well, look who's here! <laughs> what? Huh? The Sal's grand text reveal. I love you too, Toma! I love you more than anyone in the world. I put my feelings for Toma into a poem. No, this is... This is all my... I love you, Toma. I love you lots. My heart melts like chocolate when you cross my thoughts. Oh, so they, like, tricked her because they wanted to embarrass her with the text messages? That was kind of shitty, Toma. This is Shishino's doing. She must have snuck a look at Toma's phone. She's awful. Mishino, I know. You like Toma too. You're just jealous. But it'll do you no good because Toma likes me. No! Stop it! What? Oh, Jesus. Well, that's why Ayaka. I mean, not Ayaka. Blah. Satomi and him were dating. Come on, nobody's around. Toma? Jeez, Toma, you pervert! Aren't you the one who put Masao's text on the blackboard, Atome? Ooh. What? I don't know what you're saying. Who else could have done it? I only showed you, Atome. I didn't do anything! So is it her, Yoshino? Or maybe she told Yoshino and they both did it. Either way, jeez. Playing dumb, huh? Yeah! Wow. Um, Kudo overheard. What is this? <gasps> Think you're hot stuff now that Toma likes you, huh? Oh my god. So Masao's getting beat up too by a bully in the bathroom. Oh. What are you looking at me like that for? Toma will never want you as his girlfriend after this Yoshino. So Yoshino had bullies beat her up. What? Bitch! Oh, oh my god, stop. Ooh, I, I just want to pause and say this for the channel. Bullying is awful. Never bully someone emotionally, you know, verbally, 
physically, which obviously she, she's been abused all three, verbally, emotionally, and physically, it's wrong. No matter what the way is, it's wrong. And if you're being bullied, go to someone, tell, and stand up for yourself, because no one deserves anything like that. I just wanted to, like, go ahead and say that, because this is a strong topic with me. You, ju you just don't bully people. It's not right. And if you're getting bullied, you don't deserve it, no matter what they tell you. So a little bit of a seriousness, but read this more. You've got some nerve, Miss Sal. Well, what? Why don't we see how lovey-dovey you and Toma are? Wh what are you doing? Let go. Stop. Oh my, Miss Sal's so lewd. What? Oh my god. I should take a picture. It'll last longer. Smile, Miss Sal. Say cheers. So they, like, molested her? Or took pictures of her with her skirt up? Or... Oh my god. Whisper. Miss Sal, I bet you know what'll happen if you tell. If you don't want that photo getting out, you better be a nice, obedient girl. <laughs> hey, you really want me to do this? Oh yeah, give her lots of love. Oh god. Why would why would the guy freaking agree to Oh my god, so she got raped. Why would a guy agree to do that? He's like sitting there questioning himself like you really want me to do this and then wow. Sn sniff. Oh, I'm thoroughly disgusted. Holy crap, Miss Al deserved to kill everyone. I feel bad for no one in this. Oh my god. Stop. No more. Is somebody there? Oh wait, that's not her. Is somebody there? Oh god. Don't hide. Come on out. Oh no. I swear if he does anything to her... Mr. Soda. Whoa, she like jolted. Holy poop. What are you doing in here? Get back to your room. It's long past lights out. <laughs> Teach her. What is it? Oh. Poor girl. No one warned me for this feels trip. Oh man. This is like over a bunch of sensitive topics. Have you calmed down? Yeah. Did something happen to you? Please, tell me whatever's troubling you. We can discuss it all you like. Huh? So, teacher did listen to Miss Al. Oh. Aw, oh, so is the teacher nice to her? I don't know, he seems so shady though. Oh man. She visited me the day before she went missing. She had something to talk about, but I was so busy I didn't have the time to listen to her. I know she was pained. I can't help but feel if I had heard her out, she never would have left us. Yeah, why did Mr. Soda lie that he didn't listen to her? Because it seems like he did. Unless he was trying to, like, he didn't want to tell what happened to Miss Al. Because not only to be publicly humiliated emotionally and then beat up and physically, you know, bullied and then for someone to actually take blackmail photos of her in like lewd positions and things and then to actually have someone rape her all in once, that's pretty no one in the world, I don't care how awful, they wouldn't deserve that. So maybe he was just trying to not tell her personal business? Is this something you can't tell me? Teacher, I... I had my heart broken. Oh. I was being silly, shutting myself in the bathroom and sobbing away over that. So she didn't even tell. It's not silly at all. I would lament the very same way all night whenever I was rejected as a youth. You've experienced it too, Mr. Soda? Hmm? You find it odd it would happen to me? Not really. 
You, you're not exactly a looker. No. W well, um... It's just that you're so nice and everyone likes you. Really? <laughs> well, I was an irritating, unpopular brat in my student days. I see. Irritating and unpopular. Sounds a lot like me. Absolutely not. You're a very charming girl. It's a teacher. You're not like those other idiot girls. Serious, kind, and calm. I adore girls like you. <gasps> Ooh, no, no, no. Teacher! Miss Al. Huh? Teacher? Uh, let go, please. Your hands are so beautiful. D this isn't funny, teacher. You're beautiful, Miss Al. Oh my god. Mmm. No! Miss Al? Why are you running away? Do you hate me? You just praised me as kind and lovable, didn't you? Now come here. N no, stay away. Oh my god! Oh god, the breathing. No! Ew, that breathing. Why? Why do you reject me? Why? Never do that to me. Ever. Oh god. Oh my god! Now, you are mine. That! Well, 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 well. Oh. That is how Nassau died, and that's some pretty heavy material, um, that Mr. Soda killed Nassau. Okay, so we definitely did a good choice killing Mr. Soda. Holy crap, we did a good choice. I, I didn't even know those awful things that happened to Nassau. Oh, so Toma saw it too, that's good that he saw that. You know, with all this stuff that Toma, the only thing he really did was he cheated on Nassau with Satome and led Nassau on. But it's just, it's awful, yes. And you should never do that. And it's not an excusable. Or it is an excusable, sorry. But, um, he didn't do anything as bad as what the other people did, I guess. So. I don't know. Sal, I'm sorry. Toma. You may have been ignorant, but it's not your fault Sal died. So don't be so hard on yourself. Rose. Look, the school is back to normal and the curse is lifted. Sal, I'm sure you're free of your suffering. This is the student council room, right? I really, I really should tell Onigiwar. Blah 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 blah. There we go. Totally words. I really should tell Onigawaris thanks. I wonder if he's in. Yeah. What are you standing around there for? Uh, um, is Mr. Onigawaris there? Oniga who? Uh, um, you know the student council president. What the hell are you saying? I'm the student council president. Huh? There's no Onigawaris in the student council. <laughs> what? Wow, rude. Everything's gone back to the usual. Ayaka and Yoshino's group are gone. So is Mr. Soda, who killed Masao. But no one seems to care. <laughs> Welp. 
Who were the people who died in the other world erased from existence? Ooh, that's pretty interesting. I still remember my friends, though, and what Yoshino and Mr. Soda did to Masao. It can't have never happened. I wonder if Mr. Onigawalrus died in the other world, too. I haven't seen Onigawalrus or Miss Fuckface since. I don't know what happened to them. They sure were strange people. You there! Face front and pay attention. I I'm sorry. <laughs> Masao is still missing, and no trace of the parts of her I found. Maybe she'll never be found. But that's alright. Masao was smiling in the end. I'm sure she's free of her pain. I'm glad, Masao. Oh. Uh. Uh. Oh my god! Okay, so maybe Masao's still pissed at Toma. Um. If you liked the video, please leave a like, comment, or subscribe, and thanks for watching! I'll see you guys in the next video. Stay sweet! Uh -huh.